Hi everyone, this is my very first video blog and my very first video ever. So I wanted to make a response to Lollipop 26's six products I cannot live without. So I guess I'll get started and hopefully you'll take a look at some of the products I recommend and maybe you'll love them as much as I do. So the first product I want to start with is MAC Studio Fix. This product has gotten me through a lot of rough times and a lot of really, really bad skin days. So what I love about this product is that it comes in so many different formulations and so many different colors that it's virtually impossible not to love it. Because I personally like the compact version just because it's really easy to carry around and also the coverage is so buildable. Like you can always put more and more on or you can have a really light uh, touch of it for when you don't really need much coverage. So what I like to do in the mornings is that I usually just dust um, with, with a blush brush or with a foundation brush and just brush it loosely all over my skin and take a concealer brush and put you know extra coverage for wherever I need it. And I've probably gone through like 20 of these. These are just amazing. And also they have a lot of different formulations as I mentioned for the Studio Fix, which also comes in like there's a mineral version now. And another one I like is their uh, Studio Mist. It's just a, you know, shake bottle. You spray it onto a brush and then you loosely dust it all over your face. So basically it's like a liquid foundation, but in a mist form. So it feels really light on your skin. And um, this is just a fantastic fantastic foundation that I really cannot imagine being without. And also it's great for skin colors um, like myself because I find it's really hard to find a good match in a drugstore and they do a color match for you you know at the booth so it's always really great to check it out. I guess my next product I want to talk about is for my hair. I'm pretty lucky. I don't really have to do anything with my hair. My hair just naturally pins straight. So sometimes it just gets really frizzy though. So that's one of the things I have to look out for. And one of my favorite products is, uh, I guess we call it Schwarzkopf. Um, it's their Color Save Conditioner. It's a leave-in conditioner. I use this before I blow dry my hair every morning. I think it adds a lot of shine to it and also keeps my hair, because it is so thin, from getting really frizzy and, and huge. It's kind of awful. So I would really recommend checking this product out. Um, it actually is a two-phase product, so like it helps defend your hair from UV. It also uh, helps with like keeping the color in your hair, so if you dye your hair. I used to dye my hair, which is why I came across this product, but since I've stopped, I still use it. I love it. Uh, I use it before I blow dry and a little bit afterwards. So you shake it, what you normally do is you shake it to activate the ingredients. So there's two phases, one part is leave-in conditioner and one part is a UV defender. So it helps make it shiny and also protects your hair. So it, it does two purposes and I really, really love this product. It's, I think it also has um, a huge line as well. So it comes with shampoo, conditioner, and, and a hair mask as well, I believe. But this is still my favorite one. If you just want to check out one, I'd check in their leave-in conditioner. Um, another product I really can't live without, which would be that of Elizabeth Arden's 8-Hour Cream. I've gone through so many tubes of this, and I probably use this for, for everything and anything. It's kind of another version of... Vaseline, but I'd say it's even better. <laughs> so I use it sometimes if I'm, I have a lot of eye makeup on that I need to remove. I'll sometimes put this onto, you know, a cotton pad or a tissue to remove eye makeup. I use it for my lips, I use it for my hands, for my feet and my heels if they're really dry and cracked. I just, I think this product is fantastic. The entire line, their 8-hour cream line is also, I highly recommend it. Uh, a friend of mine used to have really chapped lips and then I recommended this to her and she swears by it now. I think it's fantastic and everyone talks about it for a reason, I think. But my formulation, the favorite one that I like to use is in the tube form because I think that it lasts longer and it's kind of, I like that it kind of gives it a gloss to your lips as well. So if it looks, it looks as if you're wearing a nice lip gloss but you're only wearing, you know, eight hour cream. <laughs> so I'd check this one out too. I really love it. And another product I can't live without would, um, a newly discovered product, I just stumbled across this because a friend recommended it to me, is the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer, Primer Potion. It is fantastic. Like everybody that probably has been using this for years and years, but I just discovered it. I wish I'd known about it 
for years and years and years because I would never let it go. Um, what you do is just basically it's a wand and it, it is a primer for, for your eyes as, as opposed to your face and it helps set your eyeliner, your eyeshadow, and it keeps it from budging. And I think that's just one of the most amazing things because I don't really have much of an eye crease, so sometimes my eye makeup smudges really fast, and I've had a lot of trouble with finding a good eyeliner to stay put. And this one is one that, this is the solution to all my problems. Now I can use whatever eyeliner I want. I've never been able to use pencil eyeliners and have them stay on me, so this is a great investment you know check it out just use it underneath your eye makeup and it glides on and it's fantastic I'd highly recommend this product and my last is a skincare product or my second last sorry is a skincare product that would be called uh, the Neostrata toning solution this is one of my favorite products because it really helps to clear your skin and I used to have you know smaller breakouts or just little pimples underneath the skin and I think that this really helps to cure all those and you know um, get rid of the oily shininess that you might have after you wash your face or in the mornings so what you do is that you know to shake it up and it has 8% glycolic acid I don't know if they carry this anywhere else other than in Canada because it is a Canadian brand but I'd really recommend it because it has 8% glycolic acid which also helps to prevent breakouts it also helps with fine lines and it just one of those fantastic products that I'd really recommend to check out and yeah so that's my last one or wait <laughs> just one more product Okay, sorry about that. And my last product would be that of the Cetaphil uh, body lotion. So I really recommend this one because it's versatile. Like I love products that you can use on your face and use on your body and, and uh, you know, double for many other purposes. You know, what's the point in just getting one thing for, you know. <laughs> so, okay, so the, for the Cetaphil body lotion, what I really love about it is that you can put a little bit on uh, your fingertips and you know add it with a bit of water and then you can put it on your face as a face moisturizer because it is gentle enough on your skin and also it's really great for the winter time because your skin can get really dry and I'm from Canada so it gets so dry and so cold and your skin just gets really angry with you so Cetaphil this body lotion just is a lifesaver you can use it for everything and um, I guess that concludes my six favorite products. And I hope that you'll discover that you can't live without them either. <laughs> so please do let me know. And I'd love to hear responses to this video and let me know what you think. And if you've tried these products and you disagree or agree with some of my picks, I'd love to hear from you. So I hope you enjoyed. And, and let me know if any feedback you have for my very first video. I'd love to hear from you. Thanks.